Hello, my name is Siobhan Cunningham and I've written a book called The Penance List. It's book one of the David Trilogy and I thought it would be a good idea to give you a, um, an outline of why I, uh, where the idea came from and why I wrote the book. Um, I've got a couple of dogs in here and they're sleeping so <laughs> I'll try not to speak too loudly if you could bear with me. Um, uh, the Penance List started because I'm getting old now but when I it was in my 20s I lived in a basement flat in London and there was a guy going around causing a bit of chaos for girls living in basement flats in London um, and he was attacking them violently um, and the police were trying to track him down he got away with it for a few years um, and he tried it on with me uh, on one occasion and luckily I got away and I helped police put the photo fit together of what he looked like and while I was doing that um, they explained to me the few things that he'd been up to um, he was quite violent and evil with the girls so um, the thought came into my head why would anybody be like that um, what's happened in his life to make him that evil um, he looked like the type of guy that his mother would love him he was smart clean intelligent looking um, okay looking you know quite handsome-ish um, and had a sort of cunning intelligent look in his eyes but um, you wouldn't have thought he was the you know um, the monster that he well that was simmering be below him was there um, he looked quite normal um, so I was wondering what ever happened to him to make him become like that in life and something started as a childhood had he been affected by something um, the police were quite frightened. They moved me out of my flat that day and got me to go move in somewhere else because he, not often do girls get away from him um, and he would return, they feared. So uh, um, um, I got moved out and um, it took them quite a few years to actually catch him but in the end they did. Um, so the seed was sown as to what would make a young guy grow into a monster. Um, and that's where I started with David and my uh, fictional character and fictional story. Um, I, David is um, a young boy that went to boarding school at the age of seven and he was abused for um, ten years at boarding school by his headmaster and his priest. Um, he has a... the, the part, part of what kept him going throughout that was an obsession he had with his childhood sweetheart. Um, he had vis envisaged that they would... Um, he would survive and then they'd go off into the sunset together. So she was his little angel that kept him alive through all the torturous um, abuse that happened to him. Um, and so we start the storyline with um, them 20 years later living in London and um, him starting his um, stalking her and a, um, obsession with her, trying to get her back. Um, so it's the story about Tara and David. Um, I hope you like it. It's, um, it's, it's quite steamy. It's got a bit of sex in it. Um, it's got a thriller that's quite a lot of swearing, sadly. I'm very sorry. I apologise about that. Um, bit of swearing, bit of murder mystery. Um, it covers all the genre, all the um, industries that I've worked in. I've worked in some fascinating industries, um, like I was modelling for a bit, and then I worked in football for a few years, then in the music industry for a few years, media for a bit. I've travelled around. I'm an old dog, <laughs> so I've used all the um, experiences I've ex experienced from those industries and put it in. Um, it's based in um, London and um, the Amalfi Coast, the beautiful Italian Amalfi Coast, so um, we get a bit of picturesque scenery as well. Um, the dogs are growling now, so I had better shut up. Um, I hope you like it. Siobhan Cunningham, The Penance List, available on Amazon, and my um, to find out more and connect up um, through social media, go to www.scunningham.com, sccunningham.com, and I hope you like it. Thank you.